All right, uh, we're told all of our lives to play nice, be kind, keep your emotions in check. But that can lead to resentment. There are some times when you don't have to stick to those rules. Speaker and author and the master of social media. If you don't follow him, you need to. Mr. Rich Bracken is here. Good yeah. to see you. Good to see you. And I'm angry if you're not following me, so follow me <laughs> you immediately. You put out some really That's, good stuff uh, on Instagram thank you. and Twitter. Thank you. And yeah. LinkedIn, too, right? Yes. Very busy. <laughs> I'm angry. <laughs> okay, so when is it okay to be angry? You know, candidly, it's it's okay to be angry anytime. Anytime okay. something gets your emotions, you know, like Mark said, we are taught all the time to play nice, keep mm -hmm. your emotions in check, but truly feeling angry is one of the best things you can do because it truly uh, it helps you understand your, your emotional range. So it's okay to get angry. Mm -hmm. It's just how you deal with it. My problem right. is, is that all my life, I, I know you don't believe this, but I've kind of suppressed, I haven't really... I'm kind of passive aggressive. Really? So I, yes. Really? And so then when it comes like today, I like, I get upset. Right. And then it's probably too much. It's like a steam kettle. Yeah, sometimes, I mean, it, 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 that's a perfect analogy, too, is that we, we let those emotions simmer, mm -hmm. and then you get to a point where you've kept it in and kept it in and kept the lid on and kept the lid on, and all of a sudden, what happens? The steam comes bursting out. I don't know if you whistle like that, yes. but I'm sure you do. I text, I've decided instead of being passive-aggressive, I'm just going to be aggressive. Yeah, just take the passive out of it. Why, yeah. what, you know, why spend but the tell time? people in an honest approach what you think. Exactly. It's all about tact and how you do it. So it's not just, let's just start going off and everybody because I've liberated my anger now. Right. Mm -hmm. It's really in how you deal with it and how you, how you convey it. But stand up so, for yourself exactly. too. What is a good way to convey it? I mean, what, how do you handle this? And so you get the emotion out, but you mm -hmm. don't do it like when you lose your job. Right. So it, my big thing is, what are you saying? <laughs> just, for yeah. example, <laughs> maybe today we, we don't know, um, but it's really about, you know, if you're going to oppose or if you're going to express anger, show a, a proposal. So if, if, if you get to a point I've done where, that, yeah, and, and, it, and mm -hmm. it truly is, I mean, it's the best way to do it because there's nothing worse than somebody who says, I'm angry about this. I hate right. this. This sucks. And here's you know, the solution. Right. Here is what I think and here, here's how I feel. But mm -hmm. then here's how I think this should be resolved or here's how th this should be done. So if you've got a communication problem with somebody, say, look, here's what what I feel is happening, but let's talk about it. Let's let me let me express what I'm doing because if you keep quiet and if you keep that anger inside, it's like the tea kettle. To You're going to blow resentment. up eventually. Yeah. Exactly. That's good. Yeah. Good advice. And then uh, if they don't heed that, what you're where you're coming from and right. why you're upset, uh, what do you do? You know, it's it, it's. You can, you can only do so much. You can't control other people, but the, the best thing about the anger part of it is that you're truly fig figuring out who you are inside. Mm -hmm. You know, one of my favorite bands, Slipknot, which you can't tell by looking at me, they have a line called, you don't always know where you stand until you know that you won't run away. Huh. And it's really, when you get angry and you find those levels of anger, you really feel, you figure out what you really truly care about, gotcha. what's really truly important. Even Jesus yeah. was angry. He drove Jesus. out the, the guys in the temple. For so then anybody so can stuff. get angry yeah. if, if Big J got angry. There you go.